Hey everyone, welcome back to Arduino Intro. Today we're diving into the world of temperature and humidity sensors with the DHT11 in Arduino. We'll explain what the DHT11 sensor is and show you how to use it to display temperature and humidity readings on the serial monitor. Let's get started. The DHT11 is a basic, low-cost digital temperature and humidity sensor. It uses a capacitive humidity sensor and a thermistor to measure the surrounding air, and it spits out a digital signal on the data pin. It's simple to use, but requires careful timing to grab data. The DHT11 temperature and humidity sensor module we're using has three pins, VCC, data, and ground. Now let's wire the DHT11 sensor to the Arduino. Here's how to connect it. DHT11 sensor, VCC to 5V on Arduino, GND to GND on Arduino, data pin to digital pin 5 on Arduino. Next, we'll need to install the DHT library in the Arduino IDE. This library simplifies the process of reading data from the sensor. To install it, you need to download it first. I'll be posting the link to the library in the description. After downloading, open your Arduino IDE, go to Sketch, Include Library, Add Zip Library. Locate the downloaded zip file and click Open to install. With the library installed, it's time to write some code. This code will read the temperature and humidity from the DHT11 sensor and print it to the serial monitor. Let's break down the code. First, we include the necessary library, DHT.h, for the DHT11 sensor. We create an instance of the DHT class for the DHT11 sensor. We define the pin the DHT11 is connected to with hash define DHT11 underscore pin 5. In the setup function, we initialize serial communication with serial.begin 9600. In the loop function, we read the temperature and humidity using DHT11 dot read 11 DHT11 underscore pin. We then print the temperature and humidity values to the serial monitor with serial dot print and serial dot print line. Finally, we add a delay of 2000 milliseconds, two seconds between each reading to allow the sensor to stabilize. Now let's upload the code to the Arduino and see it in action. Open the serial monitor to see the temperature and humidity readings every two seconds. As you can see, the temperature and humidity readings are now displayed on the serial monitor. This simple project is a great starting point for more advanced weather stations or environmental monitoring systems. And there you have it, a straightforward way to read temperature and humidity using the DHT11 sensor and an Arduino. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Arduino Intro for more exciting projects. Leave a comment below if you have any questions or suggestions. Happy coding!